let's go ahead and move into the next platform. So this is Orders in Web Apps. Uh, it's got an interactive demo as well. I do want to mention uh, with the Orders in Web Apps, you get your own marketing page uh, simply because, you know, obviously with the Orders in Local Search, you get the search site, which is your marketing page, and it's the online ordering site. Uh, the Orders in Web Apps, obviously you don't have a search site, so uh, yours is all online ordering specific that are custom branded to uh, the merchant. So, of course, you do need your own mar marketing site. This is your marketing site here. Um, it will obviously be your own logo, your own domain, uh, and then you can customize whatever you need to. But it's a really great graphical way of showing what it is that you do, what you provide to merchants whenever you want to send them your website. Kind of summarizes that information. It's got your ordering products on here. Uh, pricing. You know, you can set your own pricing as well if you have a setup fee and all the stuff that you do provide with that. And they can contact you from there. And then so in, another great thing is that there's a built-in demo here. And I'm actually going to use this demo to show you orders in web apps. Uh, again, restaurant or retail. Retail because they're shipping, uh, shipping integrated whenever you do select a business for retail. But let's go to this restaurant one. So as you can see, uh, this is for Buck's Pizza. You'll be able to see the entire menu here. It's very similar to a smartphone app. It doesn't matter what smartphone they're using. As long as they go to the domain, they'll be able to see this. So let's view the details here. And of course, if you want to add that item, you can do that. You'll pick it up. And then after that, enter in your information. Of course, credit card processing, you can do all that stuff as well. And pretty simple from there. Let's go back to the demo. Of course, we've got the online ordering website, as you would imagine, much larger. This is for the desktop. Salads. All the different categories are in here. And you know, they can use this as a standalone site too. We provide a domain, <clears throat> we provide a generic domain. So if they don't have a site, they can use uh, the generic domain that's provided. And obviously the tablet app. And let's look at the Facebook ordering. So again, this is their Facebook fan site. <clears throat> they can they can use this. Um, you know, if they don't have a website, this is really a great way. If they don't have a website, um, you know, they've got the online ordering button here. You can see we're still in the Facebook site, and and online ordering is directly built inside there. So folks can go ahead and order whatever they want from that Facebook page. And this is really great. I uh, want to reiterate, uh, you know, if you know, obviously Facebook is a very big site. Uh, its SEO is very, very high. Its ranking in Google is very, very high. So even if they don't have a website, the Facebook fan site is going to come up first. So when that comes up first for a restaurant, you know, their menu is already built in. So they don't even need a website in most cases. So this is a great way to even target those businesses that don't have anything. Um, just set up their Facebook fan site for them. If they don't have one, it takes about 10 minutes to do, and the menu is easily integrated. Uh, we have instructions for doing that. The great thing is once once you update your menu or if they update their menu, it's pushed to all the platforms. It's pushed to the, the smartphone, the tablet, the desktop, and the Facebook ordering, so they don't have to update four or five different menus. So really great, nifty feature to uh, offer merchants, uh, especially those who don't have anything. And of course, you got retail. So here we have one for purses, I believe. And as you can see, the mobile for purses. And then obviously, um, they have the same for the online ordering website. Again, the Facebook site as well. So really great thing for either, you know, whether it be restaurants or even retailers, they can put their stuff in here and order directly from Facebook or order from you know, mobile, tablet, whatever it may be. And um, yeah, and they can they can put that link directly into their website. They do have an existing website. They can do that as well. Uh, okay, so again, um, you know, two really great platforms. 
Uh, we've got the orders in web apps, orders in local search. Obviously, they're two separate platforms. So whichever one you think would be better for your area, obviously, everyone's market is a little bit different. Some people like the local search. Uh, they, they think it's better. You know, some people want to market directly to the business themselves and, um, you know, and, and, and provide the Facebook ordering. In that case, orders, uh, orders in web apps is, will be perfect for that. You know, and sometimes we have licensees that say, I want to start this business, you know, com with the complete options. They get the orders in uh, local search and the orders in web apps. That's a great way to do it because, you know, sometimes businesses want one or the other or they want both. So it's a great thing to, you know, be able to offer both services as well. That's something you can do uh, if you choose to. So let's go back to the presentation.